Hello and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Sylvia. Please remember to like, subscribe, and turn on the notifications. For today's video, I'm going to be talking about the seven gifts of the Holy Spirit. While I'm at it, I'm going to be creating a word cloud since um, I've noticed that it gets a lot of traction on my channel and it is the most, it is the most viewed uh, video on my channel so then i decided i'll create one in real time because a lot of the people were telling me to do so so the first thing i like to do when i'm creating a uh, word cloud and i'm using photoshop which i've never used before i normally like using illustrator and you'll see if you'll see why if i decide to recreate um the same or rather use fruits of the holy spirit to do um a word cloud for illustrator you'll notice why exactly i like to use illustrator illustrator as opposed to photoshop but since you're using photoshop for those who like using photoshop i decided let me do one on photoshop and people like me explaining i'm not sure what i can explain in a real-time video as opposed to doing a time lapse because i feel like it's very self-explanatory but I don't know maybe you just want me to do it as you do along i'm not sure so i decided to use the font um helvetica in this case and um and a, a bold helvetica you'll see and at this point i'm just centering the word in the middle and normally i use the title like i'm doing the gifts of the holy spirit which are basically seven gifts um, it's it's during Lent and I figured Easter is coming so uh, I was thinking of what words can I use and I was like oh yeah the gifts of the Holy Spirit the seven words and it's a good um, it's I guess it was a good example to use to show you how to do a word cloud with say seven let seven words so yeah so getting started I use gifts which is the title like I said and I like to center that with capital letters in the center as you can see and um, yeah that gets that helps me get started and then I like to choose a range of colors that I'll be working with and you'll see I've, I'm ranging between the colors purple and pink and a bit of red and um, yeah so then that's what I use and the reason I put the word in the middle is because of that's the title and everything else is centered around that so the first um, the first gift of the Holy Spirit is wisdom and that's what you see me writing there so now the other words are gonna be centered or rather surrounding the word gifts which is basically the title of the words around it so yeah we thought that the gift of knowing right from wrong and of which choices to make in life in order to live a holy life and avoid stepping off of God's path. Um, so that's why wisdom is one of the gifts of the Holy Spirit. I did use pink because I just wanted to see how the colors work with each other. And the second um, gift of the Holy Spirit is understanding. I just said it to do the seven gifts of the Holy Spirit. So then um, it's kind of hard to illustrate this. So this would be a nice stock um, photo. I normally like using word clouds for stock images of words that are, you know, hard to find or rather images that are hard to find. And I think doing it as a word cloud makes it easy for like a religious or spiritual um, stock so yeah understanding the gift of tolerance sympathy and compassion for others the gift allows for us to comprehend and grasp the meaning behind the teachings of the church and of how to aid others in needs so understanding yes is a gift of the holy spirit and then we have the third gift of the holy spirit which is counsel the gift of judgment prudence and guidance with counsel comes the knowledge necessary to guide ourselves and others in following the teachings of the church and to do God's will. This helps us to make the right judgment calls when making choices to live a life faithful to Jesus Christ. So at this point you'll notice that I'm just um, using the titles of the gifts and 
shuffling them around as you can see and changing the color kind of eyeballing and seeing which colors match best so that the colors are not just the same and they are different fourth gift is fortitude and fortitude is the gift of strength and courage that helps us to stand up for our faith in christ and to suffer and endure the persecution and obstacles that may keep us from practicing our faith The fifth gift of the Holy Spirit is knowledge. Knowledge is the gift of enlightenment that enables us to choose the right path that will lead us to God. It also encourages us to lead others and to avoid obstacles that could keep us from Him.
piety piety is the sixth gift of the holy spirit and the gift of it is the gift of reverence and confidence in god and fills us with the love and joyful longing to serve god and the church and enables us to see him in all events through a holy life of prayer and devotion And lastly, we have the gift of fear of the Lord, which is basically the gift of wonder and respect uh, that encourages us to be in loving awe of God. Our fear of the Lord is not so much about being afraid of eternal punishment for our sins, but more so out of fear of offending or displeasing him as if he were a loving parent.
so with this uh mentioning of the whole, the gifts of the holy spirit i hope you learned something i hope i was able to demonstrate the gifts of the holy spirit alongside being able to create it under a word cloud and use this representation of the graphics i've used so that it can be used as an image for representing the theme in case uh, anyone needed a banner or a title or a header then this would be a good example so leave your comments down below let me know what you guys think thank you for watching and let me know if you prefer using photoshop or illustrator if you want to check out the other um word cloud that i did previously um subscribe on the channel and i'll place it somewhere on the end note at the end of this um image and i hope you guys will um subscribe so that i can recreate the fruits of the holy spirit and uh, illustrator that's only if you guys want me to do it again um explaining as well so see you in the next video like comment subscribe and see you in the next one bye